Hey guys, it's Poxbro. Welcome back to another video today. In Fallout 76, I'm going to be doing another Atomic Drop Weekly update, and this is for June 1st to June 8th. All right, so the first one that we have is going to be Comforts of Home, and this looks like a new bundle. I don't think I've ever seen this before in the shop, and it has a bundle and looks like a bunch of different other items here. Uh, what's included in the bundle is a couple prefabs. So this is like the main prefab. It looks like a trailer with some stairs leading up to it. There is a six pack loot bag. So this is like a loot bag when you die or if you uh, drop something. We have a rustic room divider, which is right here. This is the mobile home trailer. And then on the top of it, it even looks like there's some sort of hot tub. Um, and then there is a red brick uh, stucco, stucco walls and milled brick floors. And so if you're interested, you can get these items individually. This is what the mobile home trailer looks like. And this is what the hot tub looks like. I wonder if people can actually like use it, the hot tub. Um, and there's a hot tub on top of the prefab as well. And then there's a red brick wall. It looks like it has some sort of gate to it, or maybe there's like a gate piece. And then this is the regular brick floor. The divider, loop bag, and then there's these two hats as well. So there's a, a matchstick hat, if you're interested, where there's some matches in the hat. And then um, there is a straw hat as well. All right, and then in the next tab, we have what was here last week, which is the Garahan Garage Sale. This is the Garahan Employee Bundle, and if you're interested, you can get all of these items separately. Uh, the bundle does not include the Surveyor Power Armor Paint, though, but it does include the Outfit, the Ore Basket, and the Mega Mansion Prefab. The Mega Mansion Prefab is pretty good, I gotta say. I've used it, I've seen it used in a couple camps, and I think it's one of the best prefabs that has been made so far, um, in my opinion. And then we also have 40 repair kits for a thousand atoms here. Next, we have the greatest hits. We have a spring bundle. Uh, I think I've seen this a couple times. The spring bundle includes a mushroom lamp, a nuclear waste barrel planter, a bestos tile roof set, brambles, a red turret pack, fall elm trees, summer elm trees, and winter elm trees. So we have trees for all seasons. We've got some roofing. We've got some bushes. This is what the nuclear waste barrel plant looks like right here. Some more of the trees planted. And this is the red turret pack. This is the mushroom lamp. And then we have the Unstoppables outfit bundle. And this includes the Barbarian costume, the Manta Man costume, the Silver Shroud fedora, the Inspector's hop hat, the Silver Shroud costume, and the Inspector's costume. And this is what the costumes look like, all four of them. This is what they look like individually here. And then we have the Vault Atrium Shelter, which is here, and the Vault Atrium Shelter is actually 20% off, which is actually, I think, the first time I've seen the atrium or the shelters on sale, so this is kind of cool. And this is just one of the, this is pretty much the biggest shelter that's out right now, and it's pretty much just a huge vault. Next, we have a Raider Collectron Station, so if you like just collecting all the Collectron Stations or, you know, just a Raider-themed one, we have this in here now. And this one uniquely collects chems and alcohol, as well as ammo and weapons. Then we have a trick or treat candy bowl, or a trick candy bowl in this case. This is a container which can dispense candy and other food in your camp. Pretty cool actually. Uh, this is a bloody Arctos refrigerator. Keep your food and drinks fresh for longer and the bloody Refrigerator will reduce spoilage rate on food and drinks items by 50%. Then we have 40 lunch boxes and 40 repair kits and 40 scrap kits, all for a thousand atoms each um, for each of these little groups. I'm gonna go ahead and get this though. And then in the vaulting leaving soon, we have all around Appalachia bundle. Um, the around Appalachia bundle has been here several times. And this includes the Voltec Cuckoo Clock, a Hunting Lodge Fireplace, a Hunting Lodge Dining Chair, West Virginia Drifter Outfit, Hunting Lodge Table, Hunting Lodge Couch, and a West Virginia Drifter Helmet. And this is what all the items look like here in the preview. 
And so yeah, that's going to be 1,500 atoms, and it's going to be going away. So if you're interested, uh, be sure to pick it up. Same here with the Greylock Villain Bundle. Uh, this one comes with the Greylock Icon, the Greylock Sorcerer Staff, which is right here. And this is just a, a skin for the Gragnock Axe. Then we have a Greylock Cackle, um, and a Greylock Sorcerer Frame, and a Greylock Sorcerer Outfit, and Greylock Sorcerer Hood, and a Greylock Sorcerer's Throne. And then we have the Starlit Sniper Bundle, which is also going to be vaulted. This is a lever action skin right here. And then we have a Starlit Sniper Hat and a Starlit Sniper Outfit. This right here is an accurate representation of the fit. And then we have the Junkyard Camp Bundle. Uh, this hasn't been around, I think, for a little bit, but now it's getting vaulted. So you can get some like Junkyard themed items for your camp. This includes the Rainwater Collector, Fusion Flea Stash Box, which I'm going to assume is this item right here. We have Junkyard Fences, and actually this is the Mothman Cultist Tripod Altar. So this is probably the Fusion Flea Stash Box then. Kind of looks like a car. Next we have the Flyboy Bundle. This is also getting vaulted. You have like a really cool looking outfit here and a bunch of barrettes essentially. And also this backpack and a player icon. And uh, I almost forgot to mention the Flyboy Salute emote. Um, a lot of bundles that are being vaulted, actually. We also have the Gragnarok Hero Bundle. This includes the Gragnarok Hero Icon, a King Gragnarok Throne, Gragnarok Battle Cry, a Gragnarok Battle Mace for the Super Sledge, King Gragnarok Headband, and King Gragnarok the Barbarian Costume. So this is kind of what the costume looks like with the Battle Mace, and that's the headband. This is the throne, um, yeah. And then we have a stars bundle for 1320 atoms. And uh, this comes with a Captain Cosmos bed, alien plushie, the satellite dish, a untarnished paint alien blaster, the invader combat knife skin, and a Captain Cosmos helmet with a Captain Cosmos suit. And the untarnished paint is an alien blaster skin. The only thing I really liked in this bundle, to be honest, is the satellite dish. It's a really cool looking like uh, structure to add to something but it's 1320 atoms for the whole thing so uh, next we have a tough guy pose which is 125 atoms and this is for photo mode and then we have a feral ghoul icon for 25 atoms next we have the free and special offers holy moly what is that apc survival to okay we'll get to that we'll get to that we have a hug cutout and this is going to be one of the free items for everybody we have a free supply package, so they're still doing the daily, like, I'm going to call this pretty much a daily login reward. An additional free item. Um, then we have the Communist Collectron Station here in the shop as well. And then for Fallout First members only, we have a ATC Survival Tent. Holy crap. This is a really cool looking survival tent. I gotta say. I I'm digging it. Wow, this is really cool. I'm going to equip this. Um, and then we have a skull mask for 150 atoms, which is pretty much 50% off. And it's going to be everything for the in-store, but I'm going to go ahead and check to see if there's going to be any staggered releases. Well, it looks like at the time of recording this video, Bethesda has not yet released the uh, Atomic Shop Weekly Update page to their website. So I will go ahead and edit the video and uh, upload it and everything. And I will check back. If there are any stagger releases, I'll go ahead and pin it in a comment down below. Uh, but yeah, that's going to be pretty much it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please let me know in the comment section below. Otherwise, until next time.